To write the name for CO2, we first have to figure out what type of compound we have. So if we look on the periodic table, we'll see that carbon right here and then oxygen, they're both nonmetals. So when we have two nonmetals, we have a molecular or a covalent compound. And we can use these rules here to write the name. So first, we're going to write the name for both elements. We have carbon and oxygen. Next, we change the ending on the second element, the oxygen, to IDE. So we cross this out and we write IDE. So now for CO2, we have the name carbon oxide. Since this is a molecular or covalent compound, we'll use prefixes, put them in front of each element based on the number of atoms present. So we have this chart down here to help us. For carbon, we only have one carbon. And we don't write mono for the first element, but we do use a capital letter. So we have carbon and then two oxygens. So that's going to be di. So the name for CO2 is carbon dioxide. If you were given the name and asked to write the formula for CO2, you'd know you have one carbon because it just says carbon. And that di tells you that there's two oxygens. So you have CO2 as the formula. This is Dr. B with the name for CO2, carbon dioxide. Thanks for watching.